Oh, hello, you caught me doing a little bit of building. Uh, I guess trying to create some paths here that make sense. You know what I mean? Just, uh, well, let me show you. All right, I think what I want to do today I guess this is where I tell you who I am and what this series is. Well, this is Amped. It's a Minecraft survival series, vanilla survival, and an amplified Minecraft world. Pretty straightforward. Here is my base. And tree farms behind, villager trading hall down here. Uh, look, you just go back and watch the last episode. You'll figure it out. But here's what I want to do today. I absolutely adore this design. I think it's so good, this house. I just think it's such a good looking little house and I want to make more in the same style. This sort of uh, autumnal Halloween village really is what I want. Oh, uh, look at these dorks. We'll have a kind of snaking up the side of this mountain and honestly the uh, villagers the villagers are already starting to make their way up the side of the mountain through these back hallways I've created for them because I want to deposit them into these houses all the way up the side of the mountain. Uh, I don't plan on walking much. Look, I've got Elytra. I plan on flying. So if I want to go to a mason, the mason house is going to be right here. So you're watching me terraform. You're watching me sort of prep for a pretty big building project. So that's the plan. It's not too involved. Just some sick builds. And I, uh, let's see what happens. Okay, we're all finished with these two buildings, uh, basically. Yeah, you know, I think this one looks pretty good, actually. The, the trim is a little weird. It's sort of like checkerboard, nether, uh, nether brick, and uh, deep slate. Uh, but otherwise, it looks pretty good. It's kind of like the, um, the pumpkin farm. <laughs> this one, on the other hand... <laughs> I keep laughing every time I look at it. <laughs> this one looks great. This little build over here, it looks like a, someone put a cow pie on top of it. Look at the roof. What is going on with that sad roof? Awful. You know what it looks like? From this angle, here, from this angle, you have to, here, let's get rid of this. Okay, bear with me. From this angle, you got to, that's an eye, and that's an eye, and this is a bill. Ignore everything on the bottom here. This is a duck bill, okay? So it's like kind of like a Donald duck face with the two eyes in the bill. It's like an emo duck. <laughs> it has an emo hairstyle. 
this is this duck walks in the black parade. What happened to you? Okay, I gotta fix this. I've gotta make a way better roof. I'm awful at roofs. You can see you wanna see a really bad one? Look at this. I mean, this is awful. Look how bad that is. <laughs> it's just like uh I'm done. That's kind of what I'm like. They're all the same. All uh, all of my rooftops are the same. So <laughs> I go to sleep. I could go to sleep down here. Yeah, I got to change this. I'm going to make the greatest, most styling roof you've ever seen. I'm already getting some ideas here. We got to really fix this guy up. Looking pretty good. Here, let me get my stuff out. Uh, yeah, no more emo duck. And I know what some of you are, are going to say, but exit flagger, we loved emo duck. Emo duck was our best friend. That's fine. You can, you can be friends with whoever you want. I'm not going to stop you from hanging out with emo duck. Just don't bring him here. Okay. Emo duck is banned. What happened up in the corner there? Uh, emo duck is banned. This is no longer emo duck. He's got a nice hat. This is fancy duck. Yeah, it looks good when I come in. Look at all these little structures here. This is looking pretty good. Ooh, what's this? Oh, a little... Oh, I thought emo duck lived here. No? Oh, well, this is cool, though. Any blocks in here that I dropped? Yeah, this looks... <laughs> there is. Look. That looks great. I'll have to work on the inside. I don't know what the buildings are going to be used for. Probably try a little bit of a... Uh, farm uh, why a sugarcane farm i was drawing my brain melted just then i could not think of sugarcane uh maybe a sugarcane farm maybe a trading hall of some sort this could be really this could be the masons i could put all the, the stone masons in here somewhere or uh whoever but i can put some villagers in there and uh I think it looks pretty good. So I think it's, I think this is my style. I'm really liking this look. What happened to the torches that I dropped? Didn't I throw some torches away? So what's the next? Well, more builds. I, I've got some more buildings to make. Um, maybe here. I don't know if I'm ready for this yet because I'm not sure what I want to do here. If I want to terraform some more. I don't know what I want to do with this platform. It's cool. A uh, little thing here. And I think I got to build this. This is going to be probably where the, the masons live because it's a, a different build. No emo duck is the name of that replay. See, I had to practice the roof pretty close to what I made. Uh, there's the original of that kind of build. You can see that I only, I don't ever build the whole thing. <laughs> Usually just do one facade. Uh, and that's how I built. Look at the B. This is a, this is in my other, <laughs> that's it. In my other series, in my regular survival series, there's a B farm. I think I started, this might all be part of the same structure but i just do it in parts right okay this is what i'm talking about i am loving this ignore that another that's another video this is going to be uh a sort of the style of the next build loving it okay let's go do it yeah that's going to be great it's going to look really good there i think this is my do you ever you have a place in your base where you go all the time to just kind of take a look at things? This is mine right here. This overhang. 
and I'll probably build something up here eventually, but this is, uh, it's going to look good. I even like that there's only a little bit of this building peeking through it. Just there's the sort of promise of more on the other side here. And in fact, you know, I'm going to build here. I'm going to continue this trail. There's going to be something here. I chiseled out a part of the, the wall here. And these all lead. <laughs> There's caves that go all the way down to my villager trading hall. So this is how I'm getting villagers up. But look at, you know, earlier in another episode, I talked about potential. I mean, come on. There's so many cool little nooks and crannies here that you could build something in and just continue this town. Uh, it's very cool. What is this? Ow. I don't know how I kept going. It looked like it stopped me, but then I kind of kept, I kind of glitched through it. So first I have to gather resources, i.e. deep slate. And some mud. Very relaxing chores. I was listening to a podcast while I did this. And then I have to frame out the house and you get a sense of the blocks I'm using. I'll just let you watch me finish this build. Okay, I think I'm done with the uh, Mason house here. And uh, I think it looks pretty good in the mix. Um, obviously a different block palette than the rest of these. We've got these up here that are uh, more autumnal, warmer kind of colors. And then this, uh, this Mason house is, it's much uh, cooler. <laughs> Look at these guys in here. There's a lot of them in here. And they're all turning into masons. Uh, except for, yeah, why not? Why? I also forgot the villagers climb ladders, but that's all right, because they can, they can climb up here. I'm not going to stop them. Look, there's even beds up here. I didn't put those beds there. The villagers must have uh, dragged those beds up there. Look what happens when I hit this. Ooh. They uh, go running. Okay, so this is my masons. Uh, you know, these are going to be the guys that give me quartz, basically. Yeah, it's coming together. It's really turning into this sort of more cohesive. I think I've got to change this roof, don't I? All right, so the last thing I'm going to do in this video is uh, fix the roof down here. Make it more kind of like this. Um, oh. I forgot, I've got this too. I've got these little, I want to put these little sheds all up. Hello? Don't, don't jump. He is a wise man just looking over this, contemplating, just contemplating life, really. I got to go sleep. There's an exposed pumpkin here. What are you doing, bud? What are we looking at over here? Did you get stuck? You're going to stay here forever. I am not going to help you get down. Goodbye. Uh, bet you wish I uh, bet you wish you had wings like this. This is a cool area in here, actually. I like this little area in here so much. What is this? A cave? There's all these little holes through here. It's really kind of cool. Oh, I looked at them. There are arrows coming at me. This is pretty hostile. Over here, though... <laughs> 
<laughs> there's so many mobs in here. There's got to be so. Look how many. There's got to be so many in there. There must be nothing. There must not be any caves below or above. Like this has to be all of the mobs for like this chunk, right? What, who hit me? Oh, arrow in my butt. And in a blink of an eye, I'm going to add a couple little accessories uh, up at the side of the mountain here and change this roof right now. Boom. Did I nail it? Did it change a lot? I only did two things. I made a, uh, I made a little tiny shack right here and I uh, fixed the roof here. I didn't really do a little bit of terraforming around. Uh, down here. Uh, let's see what this looks like now. So yeah, I'm done for now for this. So there is a path from all the way down here, all the way up to my base now. It kind of starts over here. Once you start here, I can even make a few more. I mean, this is kind of where it is. I might actually build something here. This isn't a bad spot, actually, for a farm. Some sort of farm, I don't know. Anyway, we follow, we start to see this sort of rustic trail, this little path. We come up here. It splits up. You can go up that way or you can go this way. Takes you to the same place. Takes you to the pumpkin farm. Okay. What was our pumpkin farm doing? Not too bad. I mean, considering I don't need pumpkins really for anything we've got our new composter here yeah can't have enough composters around uh we got the masons we have got these two new builds i don't know what's going to be in here what should go in this one this is going to be villagers i'm going to connect this it is connected it's already connected oh that's this is the Masons are on the other side here. Oh, I know where I am. I actually kind of know where I am now. Yes. All right, I know where. All right, we got to get some villagers over here and get them up into this build. They're all trying to sleep in this one bed. Meanwhile, what's going on up here? There's a bed right here. Folks, I don't think that's correct, but anyway. Anyway, okay. Uh, look how good it looks already. Let me go back in time and show you the roof because have you ever renovated a house and like just uncovered a, a massive nest of spiders? There were so many. But the Iron Golem ended their chapter. So I redesigned the roof. The new one is certainly an improvement. Good job, me. That's good enough. Anyway, that's it for this video. I wanted to get it out this month because, uh, you know, we've got these uh, uh, autumnal themes uh, happening with the colors here. Although I want to carry this palette uh, throughout the rest of this build. I just think that it just looks good. I think this is just my style, to be honest. But it also has kind of a Halloween autumn uh, vibe. So, uh, you know, some ideas for you if that's what you're looking to build. Uh, there you go. All right, I'll see you in the next episode. Take care.